Hey, what's up guys? Before the video starts, I want to do a huge shout out to my Patreon who just pledged like $20. That's like the limit I set for that. So here's your shout out and I'm going to do it at the beginning of the video instead of the end. Uh, Jeffrey or YouTube.com slash user JazzyJeff2. Now, I'll probably leave that in the description for people to check out if they want to. Uh, just be warned, I'm not going to necessarily do this every time. But because this is like the only patron I have, I'm assuming the more I get, the less extravagant these will be. But just want to put that in the beginning of the video on to the rest of the video. Thanks for being my patron, Jeffrey. And for any of you all who want to do it, link in the description. All right. Peace. Yo, what's up guys, the Insane Game Freak here, here to bring you a video. Yeah, that was something more of that, didn't you? No. And I'm not sorry about it either. Okay, so Funimation recently announced that Season 7. Fuck. One Piece and they announced that Season 7 of One Piece had been licensed and is going to be dubbed and will be start being released in the summer of 2015. Now, for those who are curious, what does Season 7 include? That includes the rest of Shibondi. Well, that includes Shibondi. I had like Shibondi. He's been split up into two parts. No, it includes Shibondi, Amazon Lily, and Impel Down, which means we'll get our boy Hancock, our rookies, which includes Law and X Drake and Bonnie and Capone and Apu, all of them. Uh, and then we'll get in Pell Down, which includes Eva Chan <laughs> or Ivankov. Uh, Izum what was it Izuma? I think it's the pronouncing it's pronunciation of the name of the scissored hand uh, lackey. She he has uh <laughs> Bon Clay's return, Buggy's return, Mr. Three's return, Crocodile's return. Well, actually, finally get to hear Jimbei English dub voice because that's the first arc Jimbei appears in officially. So that's something to look forward to. And then from that moment on, we'll wait and see if we get the arc in which Ace says, Luffy, Urgy, Luffy, Urgy. Ace screams Luffy and Whitebeard's name, all the, I mean, obviously he doesn't call him Whitebeard, he calls him Pops, but it's like, he, he screams that name so consistently, and it's like, and a lot of people were even worried about this, about how Travis Willingham is going to make Ace sound like a bitch, because it's Ace. First off, Travis Willingham always plays characters who can sound badass on any occasion, but to have him play Ace in bitch mode is going to be interesting, because I don't know how well he can handle that, but we'll see what happens. So, you're probably wondering why there isn't a freak out video. I think it's because consistently we've been getting these announcements so much that it's kind of hard to freak out. Especially also considering that, as I said, Thriller Bark is my favorite arc. And granted, I like Amazon Lily. Also, I believe that one thing is in order. I think Colleen should play Hancock and Luffy because then she can say she's truly in love with herself. It is hilarious to have a character who's in love with Luffy, it'd be amazing if you got Colleen to play it. And I know they won't because they've already set that rule that they don't want the main cast playing too many side characters. And to have Colleen play Hancock and Luffy seems way too much, especially considering Hancock is pretty consistent around for like these next at least three arcs. Because she's in Amazon Lily, we're going to see her at the beginning of Impel Down, we're going to see her during Marine Ford, and then we're going to see her at the end going into the time skip and we're even going to see her at the beginning of the time skip so it's like she doesn't go away like you consistently see Hancock for a while so yeah we can't really have her running around with the same voice actress but I thought that'd be hilarious if that did happen so to kind of talk about it it's not that I'm not necessarily excited because I am excited I'm glad that my favorite series is getting pushed especially considering where I'm at mentally with the series which gets into another thing on the One Piece podcast, they had uh, the dude who announced it on there. He mentioned something about simo dubbing, which is something Funimation has been messing around with, and something they haven't really gotten too much credit for because most people don't know about it. Because the only way you would know about the simo dubbing is if you actually either are really into the industry 
or you subscribe for their elite subscription to get the simul dubbing. What's the simul dubbing, you ask? It's pretty much when they take a simulcast show. I think they're doing it with Tokyo Ghoul, Assassination Classroom, and something else I don't remember. I think they did it, they actually did it with, well, Space Dandy wasn't a simul dub, whereas Space Dandy was a dub first, because I think the dub for Space Dandy came out before the Japanese version of it is. But the whole concept is, is that they're dubbing each episode instead of trying to like wait until it all finishes and then get all the license they're just getting it all at once and dubbing as a simulcast which is cool but kinda bad at the same time because for certain shows especially new shows like Assassination Classroom where you have nothing to build that on you're literally just kinda jumping in and being like well I, you better get used to this character because next week you're gonna come in and do some voices work and I don't know how big the gap is between when the dub version of that episode comes out I have to say it's probably within a week because it can't be too long or else it kind of defeats the purpose. Well, they brought this up for doing this for One Piece. Now, as a lot of you may have realized at this point, if they were to do that for One Piece, that is cool but kind of painful at the same time because that means you have to then cast characters for all the newer characters that have been introduced since, I guess it'd be Dress Rosa or going into whatever art comes after that. Dress Rosa and all the new characters that haven't even been picked in the English version yet. And on top of that, you're doing that while also dubbing the previous episodes. And I think that one of the reasons why he mentioned he would th he's, they're thinking about doing this is because One Piece of the show is probably the one they're furthest back on. It's like, if they continue at the pace they're at now, they won't be caught up for like another five years, which is ridiculous. Especially because it's like, yeah, you have the license to everything up until the end fell down. But we gotta realize, it hasn't been dubbed yet, nor has it been released yet. In terms of release schedule, that's nuts. And me personally, I want to kind of just talk about it because I suggest a lot of people do tell them that we want simulcast dubs because I would pay for simulcast dub of One Piece, particularly for two reasons. One, because the anime is kind of dragging for me personally right now, which is partially due to the fact that Toei, and I'm blaming Toei specifically, and for some reason Toei is like, well, we can't just put a filler arc. I think this is one of the few times we go, well, because One Piece, and here's my thing, One Piece has good has good filler. Like the, the Law, Chopper, Luffy thing that happened right before Dressrosa, that should have been extended for at least a good bit. Because you're trying to do Dressrosa while the manga's in Dressrosa, and you're only, you're less than maybe 10 chapters behind, and what this leads to is you dragging out sections of the manga, and they've been doing this for a while now, but it's become painfully apparent. I mean, it's painfully apparent in Dress Rosa, where everyone's just like, for the love of God, Toei, put it on a filler break. It doesn't even have to be like 50 episodes, just make it like 10 or 20. Give Oda some time to get ahead, because you, you, this whole half a chapter, one chapter thing, an episode is not working. I think most of them have been half a chapter lately, which, you know, One Piece has the ability to be stretched like that, no pun intended, but at the same time, it's becoming drawing as hell. So having a dub simulcast for that would make the experience a lot better. Because even if we have to deal with that, at least I have the advantage of enjoying new voices and new and how they're going to pl play on the quirks and how they're going to handle everything. Granted, it's probably one of those things when they officially come out to like releasing those box sets, they may have to go back and fix a few things because obviously you're getting adjusted the characters you literally that are literally are just showing up in the anime, so you don't have the same ability. Now, granted, I don't think the Straw Hats are going to have any problem because it's the Straw Hats, and two, they've been doing this. Well, most of the Straw Hats have been doing this for over almost three some 300 episodes, you know, minus probably Robin's only had about 200, which is still a lot. I think Frank, I think Patrick Seitz and uh, uh, Ian Sinclair will have the most trouble. Probably Ian Sinclair because he has like the least number of episodes under his belt. He really only has like Thriller Bark, uh, uh, Strong Road, and Film Z. And he's going to have to get readjusted. Plus that, a lot of the strats are going to be taking breaks anyway because of, well I don't know, maybe it's because of weapons and Shabondi and they're not really relevant for like almost, what was that, almost 200 episodes? No, I'm exaggerating. It's probably, I know it's almost 100, though. It's like nuts. They Well, because they kept throwing them back in for filler, but like in terms of canon material, they're not, well, for voice acting, they're not going to be around for a while. So, yeah, having them summer double make sure they don't get any rustier or any on that kind of crap. 
Uh, but I would personally prefer a Sama dub for a lot of Shonen Jump shows. I kind of wish Viz would do that for Naruto and Aniplex. Oh my god. And let this catch on and let Aniplex do this. Aniplex, put that on the premium for Crunchyroll. If you did Sama dubbing of like shows like Durara, and I think Aniplex needs to do this more than anyone. Because Aniplex is that type of company that will charge you a ridiculous amount of money for an English box set. So I'm like, if you're going to charge me a premium price, at least give me the option to watch the dub the legal way under a premium, you know, for me paying like $8 a month on Crunchyroll and just do kind of a simulcast dub. Because I would, hey, that would help you out and us. That way, for those who aren't going to pay the premium price, because there's a lot of people who's not going to spend over $100 on a 20-something episode box set, you have some people who will. But not everybody's going to do that, and that's kind of the point. Now, you know, One Piece, I'm not even really worried about that in terms of how everyone feels. I think everyone would be fine with a simul dubbing. I don't have any problems with that, but like I feel like Samo dubbing is like the next step in the anime streaming industry. Like if you're gonna, if we're gonna go to this digitized age, you know, Samo dubbing would be, that'd be G as hell. And I really hope this takes off for Funimation. The reason why I haven't really subscribed to Funimation services because I'm the type of guy who buys box sets anyway, so it's not gonna bother me to miss a few episodes, to miss like, oh, oh, you didn't go, you didn't subscribe to the Elite subscription service to watch Assassination Classroom English dub? Nah, because I'll probably end up buying the box set for the fucking thing anyway. But it, this will work for dub fans, because dub fans, I don't give up what anyone says, is still a part of the anime fandom. And the reason why a lot of people don't get in the simulcast is because it's in Japanese. A lot of people who like anime do like watching English dubs. So if you made an English dub streaming service or English dub simulcast, that means they get to have the same conversations as the sub only fans. So you have more people participating in the community as a whole, and they get to watch their anime in the language they want to watch their anime in. So for all intents and purposes, I would like simul dubbing to do insanely well. I may I might just go ahead and subscribe to it just for the support because I really think. This would would help a lot. This would help the community in general. I would love to see more dub fans get into this, just because Funimation, maybe Viz along the lines, of Dep, and it's like you have no choice. You need to do this, <laughs> especially if we get a Magic season three. You better fucking do this. So first off, I'll leave the link. I'll leave the comp the information in the description to do to tell Funimation that we want One Piece Samo dubbing. That's the first step. Second step is to push the living hell out of simul dubbing because to me that can only be good things. Even if you don't like dubs, the Japanese version is still going to come out first anyway. So what's the problem? And you'll have more people to talk about. Also, it's to me because I've noticed when it comes to Japanese simulcasting, that's the thing that's kind of the bridge in between. It's like, well, I don't really like watching things and subs. I'd rather have an English language so I don't care about watching simulcast. Well, if you put in an English language they'll care about the simulcast. And then you get to have people enjoy the love and the hate relationship with simulcast. Which, depending on the show, can be amazing or torturous. 90% of the time it's the latter. But we're not going to tell them that. Shh. Anyways, please leave your thoughts and comments in the comment section below. This has been the Insane Game Freak. Life's a game, but a win. And I look forward to hearing my waifu in English. Colin, if you did that, that'd be G. So G. So G. So G.